Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Insurgent with Grover Games. So we're still in the Fernal Cold base here and we're supposed to be working towards... Oh... Finding Zenith and helping him with his speech here. <gasps> Will you heal me? Yes! Sweet. Well, the lava aesthetic we've built up is pretty cool, don't get me wrong. It's just, I really wish we had air conditioning. The thick uniforms are not helping and the lava is sweltering. Sorry, bud. What do you have to say back here? I've already sorted everything out, so please don't go rifling through the boxes. It took me days to sort it out alphabetically. I want to, I want to mess up your stuff, man. Let's, let's keep going. What's this way? This looks like a. Oh, damn it! I didn't want to go. Crud. Let's get this started then. How do I look? Look fantastic, sir. Your hair looks great. Glad to hear it. Are the cameras rolling? They will be in a second, sir. Just give us a moment to... Hey, it's Manipi. What? Is that a Manipi? What is a legendary Pokemon doing here? It's the prisoner. What's going on? How did you escape? Harp swap, man. It's Manipi's ability. A move only it can learn. In battle, it switches the stat changes of two Pokemon, but outside, well, whoever was standing here is is, is in whatever prison cell where you kept me. Gigi, you could come out too. Give me a hand. I should have realized. Of course you would use your pixies to bust your way out. Not that it matters. The entire region is under my control, as well as two of the most powerful Pokemon in existence. Heat Ran and Groudon. A prophecy and the future itself protects me. Remember, I was at the library with you. I heard the oracle tell that the chosen one would join my cult. I'll tear you two apart, one Pokemon at a time. So who wants to go first? You, s you say first like you'll stand even a chance against me. You're the leader of the Infernal Cult. You use fire and ground types. I run a range gym. You won't less last five seconds. All right, we'll use the table. You two better get this on camera. I want the entire region to see me throttle the person I told them to hate. Three, two, one, and see you later. Whoa, okay. Well, that was easy. You look confused. Did you really think I was going to battle him? I don't take risks when I can help it. This isn't a game. That trap door opens to, a, to deep into the base. Very deep. Did you honestly believe I let, let this be easy for you? Groudon, come on out. You, on the other hand, I want to keep for myself. You are supposed to join me, after all. But most importantly, I can beat you fairly. So, let's have at it. I want to enjoy every last moment of the battle before I take my place as Augur. <clears throat> Who's first? Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Um... I don't know who I want to send in to take care of. I don't think bears will survive. I think Loco is going to be the best choice. Let's hopefully not flinch. There we go. I don't think bear. I don't think. Oh. Let's say, can we? There we go. Mmm, let's, let's switch in Millie. Millie's got pretty good... Let's throw up a perma for us. Oh gosh, is Millie gonna go down? Yep. Crud. Well, at least we'll get a free switch in, and I think Bears is gonna be the answer right now. And if I knew he was gonna use a full restore, I would've... I would have freaking, oh, I would have freaking set up a swords dance. Avoided the frost. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't know what the right move is. I think Iron Head is going to be the best move. Well, maybe not. I forgot he changes to fire type. Okay, thank lord. The 
full blaze can melt it. Oh, I never thought of that. I suppose fire types can melt the frost. That's interesting and good to know for future battles. I think Bear's gonna start going. Oh no, Bear's! You can't! You can't do this now, bud. We need you to pull through and just sweep through the team. There we go. And he ran. There we go. Bears coming in clutch with the sweep. Plus five. 310 attack. Holy. No! This is totally impossible! Not gonna lie, I was a little bit nervous there. Impossible! And now I can't even stand up. Slumped against my Pokemon. How embarrassing. Mr. Stennis, sir, I have a... Can I help you? Your timing isn't great. Oh, wonderful. GG, fa GG found you already. And defeated you, too. How perfect. All the loose in Those loose... All the loose ends tied up. Wait. Is that... Persona? Oh, Seneth. I honestly thought her plan... Her plan wouldn't work. I should have doubted her. I guess you really are blind. What are you talking about? Excuse me, GG. Don't recognize me yet, eh? Hold on, let me take this suit off. There we are. Remember me now? What if I talk in this voice? You're the prophet from the library. Ugh, you're not real? Of course not, dude. Who actually believes that crap? Man, I thought you... you I thought you figured it out when you mentioned L. Frank Baum. You know what book he wrote, right? The Wizard of Oz. And do you remember the plot twist of that story? The wizard was fake. There was no magic. Just a single man pulling some strings. A few flashy lights, fancy explosions, time smoked. It's really easy to fake an amazing effect. So there was no prophecy. Who knows, maybe there really was one a long time ago. A hero that would rise up and defeat the cults. It seems to be coming true after all. But the one I told you, definitely fake. You were never actually supposed to recruit GG. That part part was made up so you drop your guard long enough for him to beat you. You're working for her, aren't you? She's been plotting against me this whole time. Sure am. She sure was. Don't you know what happens if she wins? Everything goes. Our existence, our world, all of it destroyed. Meh. She'll help me through those minor setbacks. Plus, I was promised a fortune. Now, GG, my boss, she pioneered all of this from the beginning. She gave me... Gave him his freaky powers, and it's thanks to her they didn't work on you. No, I'm not a cultist. I guess the best word would be mer mercenary. But the person I work for, you do not want to get on her bad side. Really, it's her fault cults even... Cults ever existed in the first place when you think about it. She gave Seneth his powers, and it's thanks to him that the other cults exist. After all, the Infernal Cult came first. You'll meet her eventually, don't worry. But for now, you have a job to do. Looking around now, I see an unconscious man with some touchable blood and broadcasting equipment. You seem pretty smart. You have maybe a couple of minutes to disband the Infernal Cult completely before Groudon gets a hold of the equipment. Let's see what you can make of that, MacGyver. Wait, so am I supposed to? He's unconscious. Hey. And a crystal piece. Um, I just want to go get the Ultra Ball. <clears throat> so I imagine I'll have to transfer. Uh, the battle you had with Senef, you probably just made million, us millions of dollars in advertising revenue. Thanks, I think. I guess I owe you one. We were under that jerkwad's control anyways. We'll, we'll be glad to pay you back however we can. We'll give you some money. Okay. We'll win a glow me. Glow gal emmy for it. Thanks, I think. I think I owe you one. We'll pay you back, yep. So, obviously... I am now Seneth. Look at me. I am the captain of the ship. The bookcase. So, I had blood, like, unconscious guy. That Seneth just got... Oh, it's really convincing. I see. That could work. 
I guess if Zenith's mind control powers were hooked up to his DNA, we could remove the mind control if you look like him. I'll get the broadcast ready. Get your affairs in order if you need to. Ready to start? I suppose. Fantastic. Here's the plan. I'm going to record you. Just basically tell the world that you will release them from your control. That should work, in theory. Lights, camera, action! Dot, 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 and cut. That was awesome, and wow, I'm definitely going to win some sort of reward for this. I guess that's it. It's hard to imagine the Infernal Cult pulled on the region just vanishing that easily. I'm at a loss for words, but thanks. You seem alright. I only seem alright. Screw you, man. What do you want, Manipi? Manipi powder. Mew now has the heart swap ability. Get in close vicinity of a usable statue and use the ability to switch its positions with you. Okay. The man if you harp swapped away. Perhaps it was looking for someone? GG, it's good to see you. Why is the cult lady with you? Persona, help me escape. We need to clear out of here. Heh, <laughs> look who it is. The mighty Groudon. Caught. Consigned to a pathetic cult. This is beneath you, Titan. Join me instead. With me by your side instead, we could rule the world. Together we could. Well, that's new. Legendary Pokemon running away from me. Never seen that one before. What's that shaking? Probably Groudon. It's heading back deep into the earth. That shaking, really? Can't be good, especially in a volcano. Is it going to erupt? Probably not, but the base built inside of it seems to be collapsing. We need to get out of here. Dora, you go on ahead. GG, I want you to follow me. There's someone we need to see on the way out. Um, okay, how do I know I can trust you? Believe me, I want to be here so much less than you do. You guys better be right behind me. Alright, kid, follow me. Just down the hall and north. I'm going to try and make a point, but... Uh, you see, don't worry. We should have some time before things get too bad. Follow me. Hello, sister. First, the base is shaking. It's collapsing. Please, you need to help me out. I finally figured it out, Daya. You were telling the truth all along. Can we talk about this later? We need to hurry. Darkrai was never going after you. It was Cresselia. I knew it! That lured it to you. It makes so much sense. In hindsight, you're considered two sides of the same coin. The new and full moons. And now it belongs to me. And you know what I have now, Dana? Leverage. With your Cresselia, I can convince Darkrai to do whatever I want. Persona, please, you need to get me out of here. Um, um, what does this remind you of? Persona, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what I did to you. But if you don't help me out, I'm go- I'm not going to make it. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way out. After all, I was able to. We're even now. I ignore her. We're in a hurry. The base is collapsing. Quickly, GG. I really need your help, please. One of the rocks that fell off, knocked, and dislodged the fingerprint scanner, so the lock is jammed. I can't open it. Right over there to your right is the administration's panel. There might be a button to override this lock and open every door in the prison. If you can find a way in, you can press it and get me out of here. Please go quickly. The bit base could collapse any minute. Uh, oh, heart swap. There we go. Gosh, something happened. Uh, heart swap. There we go. Let's go, lady! GG, I owe you one. You saved my life. Let's get out of here. Oh, Dana, GG, thank goodness you two are all right. I saw Persona escape earlier, but I didn't want to leave until I saw you two. We're fine, Nora. Thank you for your concern. You don't need to. Well, that was loud. I guess that's the end of the Infernal Cult. Kind of ironic that a cult of fire and ground was buried beneath the earth. Listen, we need to press forward. I don't have any Pokemon. Persona took them all. I'm going to go trace her down. She's clearly going to try something with Darkrai again. I think it would be best if you two just went into Nara Town and continue through the Pokemon League. There's no Ace Gym, not since the first Augur disappeared, but maybe you can find a leftover badge so you can enter Victory Road. Anyways, I'm going back to Shade Forest. I'm going to confront my sister once and for all. Hey, uh, Gigi? I didn't want to ask you this in front of her, but did you see Kalareth get out? I haven't seen him yet. I'm sure he's fine. I'm just a bit worried is all. Never mind. I'm sure he got out okay. I'm going to keep going. Nerd Town seems like a safe bet, but I'm going to check out Gale Town. That's where the Augur ran his gym. I'm sure there'll be some information 
about where we can find badges there. I think it's best if we split up. You just keep going south, okay? And stay safe. We may ha have beaten two of the cults, but I know three more that will love to get their hands on us. Don't let your guard down. Three more cults. I mean, obviously there's the... The Dark Cry cult. Oh, uh, the Perfection. Who's the third cult that I'm not thinking of? Uh, it doesn't matter. Let's get everyone topped off. I'm glad that we got through that cult fight pretty much unscathed. I I didn't think about like permafrost like melting from fire types entering the battle. That that was an interesting Oh a very interesting Oh mechanic. That's what the I'm look the word I'm looking for. Wait, where's your sister? Seriously, the I'm- I'm just gonna keep walking. Just get out of here. Uh, we're gonna take the Pika taxi. Well, us head, head south, so... That's near our town. Um... So, there's one thing I wanted to do here. Route 12... I think it was in... Yeah, it was in Merc Forest. I think, if I remember right, that was the one with the guy asking us to take care of a bunch of spiders for him. And I'm pretty sure the whole statue thing is what we need. We needed to continue, maybe. The heart swap ability. Let me in. So, we already cleared a bunch of spiders out earlier. Let's go, doo doo. Can I do a heart swap from here? Yes, I can. Interesting. But, this doesn't get me anywhere. Let's heart swap again. So there's like so many areas with these statues that I kind of want to go back and try to explore them, but I don't remember where they all are. Delta Metagrossite S? What the heck is that? Oh. Well, there's a spider up there. Wait. <clears throat> How do I get to that? Where? So we move. Okay, so we move the statue wherever we heart swap. But my question is, is it a puzzle type thing or what? That's what I don't understand. Because the issue is when we heart swap up here, I don't know. This is really, this is really confusing. Cause the only spider we have left is up there. And that doesn't get us any work either. Gosh, this is gonna bug the heck out of me. Uh, I think we'll do a little cutaway quick. Oh uh, no, yeah. uh, we'll come back to this later. Because I know there's other places of statues too. But I'll have to, I'll have to go back through my footage and see about looking it up. Because I, I don't, I feel like there's a lot of good items we could get with having it now. Let's, let's just head on. So, it said to, she said to keep heading south. 
So did I miss a cave or something somewhere? Wait, is this it? I'll be right back. I gotta take this phone call quick. Alright everyone, we're back. Sorry about that. I had to take the call, so... But we're gonna continue on here. What do you have to say? I wonder how you're supposed to get to this cave from... Duran if you don't have Waterfall. I can't think of a single way. Ooh, a mammal swine. Ooh, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Let's say, Oh, I don't have anyone with levitate. I was gonna... Or flying. I keep forgetting that. Gosh, Mammoth Swine is just beating me. Just, just go away, piggy. Yeah, I'll stick. say this should be oh okay I was like this shouldn't be a too bad of a matchup the seed bomb my way through it Kingler is this the first time we've seen Kingler in here I think so no I always kind of thought about doing like a odd Odd Pokemon run game type thing, like using using more of the unappreciated Pokemon, I should say, or such like Kingler, but I guess the reason I, I kinda stay away from that is because it seems like in quite a few of those games it gets I don't know, it seems like you don't get them very early, so to speak. At least I feel like anyways. There's a chat out up there. In this house. What do you have to say to me, lady? Are you interested in trading Pokemon? For you? See, I am the owner of a rare Delta species. I'll trade it to you if you want, but I need something sustainable in return. My Delta Jaffarig were a fully evolved Pokemon with the strongest fire, water, or grass type techniques. That's Frenzy Plant. Okay. I don't have any one of those. Let's see here. But I'd be interested to see what this Delta Jaffarig is. Um, so Bears is sitting pretty good right now for experience. Let's bring out Mjolnir for a bit. Hey, you're huge. You, you're the tallest person I've ever seen. Am I, kid? Am I really? Isn't Klefki psychic? Or not psychic. Fairy? I can't remember. I know it's Steel. been a while since we actually like used Milner. I know I tried using him earlier, but I didn't I didn't think about Mega evolving him. Here we go. I mean grass knot makes the most sense, kind of? Eh, not really. Let's just switch him out and go into We'll go into Loco. He should be able to absorb by anything he's Helios Heliosk sell the blow. Yeah. I can't in English right now. Throws at us. I was gonna go into the bears just for the safe electric switch, but Loco needs some needs some lovin'. He's a big boy. He needs he needs some EXP lovin'. Wanna join the Navy, youngster? Not really, bud. And let's Mega Evolve. So I still haven't decided. If I wanted to do a rain team or not, or something like that yet, I think it'd be a fun thing, especially with Mjolnir, it's Mega Evolution. And I know there it says it could be like Extreme Darkness, which is like the new moon thing, but if I went that route, I wouldn't, like, it would knock Killian's 
fairy type into the ground, and it would it benefit more around ghost and dark types, which I don't I don't feel like there's a lot of ghosts and dark types that I really personally like, I should say. What I have to say, Sheriff. Hey kid, do you have permit for those Pokemon? Oh yeah, trust me. I do. I thought Flash Cannon had a lot more power points. Loud. Well, let's just Thunderbolt you. Boom burst. Ooh, that actually. That did a substantial amount of damage there. A Sep Strika. Uh, let's. Hmm. Ah, Loco. What does Ion Dolt. I don't know what that move does. That's the second time I've seen it in this game. I, I don't remember what it does. I feel it. Oh, it's gonna bug me. And I said that last time it came up too. It's this way. Anything over here? Oh, a Karakoska. Oh, there's a path down this way. Hyper Potion. Hit me. <clears throat> uh, let's put. You know what, Killian needs some experience. Let's, put her, let's get her some. Listen, I've been in a bit of a slump lately. Mind if we battle to get my spirits up again? Uh, sure, lady. Chat out. Mm, let's move Blast ya. We gotta... Uh, I was hoping that special attack drop did a little bit more for us, but didn't do too much. Oh, so... Ooh, you hurt, bud. Oh, if he's just gonna keep using Aqua Tail, let's... Let's switch into Loco here. I'm kind of glad I went with Loco. I feel like he's been doing pretty decently. Oh. And let's... Let's, let's punch the Lyperd. We'll just see bomb it. Well, thank you. I've had a wonderful time. Thanks for the money, lady. Uh, high proportion. Get Killian topped up. We're almost topped off. I guess I am getting to that point where... Oh, where we're starting... Probably going to need to start using other... Potions. I actually wonder... Stop catching me, you dang turtle! Turtle! I don't know why I said twortle. Don't mind me, I can't English right now. All these kids are out playing Pokemon when they should be out looking for jobs. Isn't that right? I'm going to post ex exactly that on social media to validate my own securities and ignore the fact that people may not share the same interest in me. That sounds kind of harsh. Leech seed, you? Gosh, you hurt! Leave me alone! I didn't realize Sylveon hits this hard. It is one of my, like, fa favorite evolutions, but... I just feel like it's hitting like a Mack truck right now. I suppose I should stop setting up just Psychic it. Oh, a cop! <laughs> Clever girl! Huh? What do you mean, pretentious? Um, so I want to go back before we finish this route, quick. Because I feel like I missed something. Actually, did I not fight you? I've been training for a marathon for six months straight. I haven't slept or eaten. You got a problem, lady. And I have a problem. Uh, let's go into Helios. Just heat. Oh, uh oh, that's that's kind of scary. Chew, chew bug. Ooh, 
I'm losing my mind. I mean, you had to have it, first lady, to lose it. Okay. So that, we just literally went around. I just, I didn't know if there was something back up this way or not. I probably can't drop down the waterfall, can I? Damn turtle, go away! Oh, I can, okay. And there we are, we've made it to Nara Town. Uh, let's go forward, because I'm curious what that thing is. You look small. Not just you, your people. They're just something very fragile about you. It's odd. It's very different. I'm not sure how to describe it. You don't know who I am, do you? I definitely do not, bruh. You haven't seen much of us, nor will you, until we make our move. I'm sorry, but this is something we need to do. Everything is just going as Mistress predicted. You and the mercenary, the fake prophet we hired to took, da took down the Infernal Cult. You took down the Abyssal Cult by yourself. And now the shards of the crystal are moving again. Very soon, you will see the true power of that crystal. Of our crystal. I really am sorry. But it's time for Earth to return to the mirror. Okay then. Well, we're going to end the episode here today. Don't. Re I personally don't like leaving on cliffhangers. But we've kind of hit our time limit for recording today. But if you guys enjoyed today's episode, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. If you're enjoying the content, please subscribe so you can stay up to date to the latest series. Above all else, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day. And most of all, thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.